So I'm telling you this so you can help me. Help myself. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wind. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marion. In today's video, doing a get ready with me chit chat using products that some of the products that are new to me and some products I haven't used in a long time. Before I jump into this video, do not forget to subscribe, give it a big thumbs up if you enjoy it, hit the notification bell, and without further ado, let's hop into it. Hello everyone, I am going to do a quick look using products that I haven't used in quite some time. I'm also going to use some products that are new to me that I got like in a trend move box and some recent purchases. So I did my brows off camera and I'm gonna do an eye look, yes. I'm gonna use the Divine Skies eyeshadow palette from EM Cosmetics. Never used this before, never heard of this brand before, but hey. I'm gonna give it a try. And this is what the eyeshadow looks like. And I'm going to, I haven't, I hope this not expired. We are gonna find out. P. Louise base um, in rumor two. So I'm definitely going to find out today. I think I probably put too much on my eyelid, but you know. While I am doing my makeup, I thought, you know, I can just make this a little chit chat, you know, because I like to chat while I'm doing my makeup. And it's been quite some time since I posted like a sit down video. I tell you, like I said before, life has been lifing and so much has been going on. I am planning my mom's retirement party along with my siblings. That is in like three weeks. That's, you know, going to take a lot of, well, it's taking a lot of planning and got to set up. Still in school, full time. I work full time. I'm a mother, a grandmother. I'm in a relationship, so I'm just trying to balance balanced life then i thought my lease was up at the end of september but it's up at the end of august so i have literally the month of june to find a place to move because i don't want to renew my lease yeah so you know your girl is stressing because Everybody wants to move to Houston, which has made the market very, very expensive. So I don't know, I'm not really a fond of these shades, but I'm gonna make it work. Okay, it's pigmented, but I'm not really like a color girl, but yeah. Now, I do like the fact that it doesn't have any, like, fallout, but, like, it's really not much I can do with this palette. Um, it doesn't have, like, any transitional colors in here, but, you know what, what ifs, I'm gonna work with what I have, work with what I got. It's not, like, bling bling, but it'll work, it's a nice, now this have fallout. But it also could be the brush that I'm using. It's giving like a little sunset color. So like I said, I have to find a new place. And this time, it's not just me who I have to consider when looking for this place. I know my daughter and then Jason so we have to like find a place that everyone likes okay I feel like this will do once I put on liner and everything it'll work out 
out. Yep, me and eyeshadow were not the best of friends. But I'm gonna move a little further and move on to the complexion. Using One Size Secure the Glow Primer. So I haven't used this foundation in a long time. Okay, a little dirty. This is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD. I wear a Y415. I really like the coverage of this foundation. Let me shake it up. While I'm finding a oop, foundation brush in this stack of brushes. So when it comes to like looking for a place, um, I was really waiting until my daughter got her car and she has a car now. And I know this is a little chaotic with me applying this foundation. It gets that way when I'm talking and doing my makeup. Yeah, my brain just scatters all over the place. We gonna get it together. So, we're gonna go look at some places next Friday. I don't know if I'm gonna like record and like bring y'all along with me, you know, as we search. Actually, the both of us have to put in our 60 day notices by the end of June. So we definitely have to like be on it. I have so much stuff that I need to go through, declutter, so stay tuned for that. And it's so crazy because I was just thinking about that when it came to my skincare. I have so many skincare products that have expired and I don't use anymore. So I'm like, now's the time for me to get rid of this stuff. So not only am I having to find a spot, host, plan, set up my mom's retirement party. Also got class. I have three projects to do. And I have been doing overtime like ridiculously since <laughs> Last year, I want to say, yeah, long story when it comes to that about my department, but, um, so basically I have a lot going on for the month of June and I didn't get an opportunity. Well, I didn't, I didn't pass my second major exam for my certification. And that's really my fault because I really didn't take the time to study the way that I needed to. And by me going back to school full time, that took away my study time because the first exam, you know, I had all the time in the world to study for it, but trying to study for a certification and go to school full time, like, and work full time, like Marion, you're not superwoman. And I have to tell myself that all the time, but I want that certification. I really do and I'm gonna get it so I have a game plan I know that the end of August I'll be moving and that'll be time that I'm going into a new semester for school my last class for this semester is ending in July so I have all the month of August to study but I I haven't had my job to pay for the exam again yet because I want to study and then um, once I move and get settled in then I'm gonna create me a schedule and I'm gonna stick to that schedule and that's the only way that 
I'm going to accomplish my goals is being a little bit more organized. So I'm telling you this so you can help me help myself and hold me accountable. Okay. This does not match my eyes, but honestly, this is the only, only blush that I have sitting right here right now. Actually, I have another one, but I'm pretty sure this one is no better. Yeah, it's definitely no better. As I add it to my face, you know, it's whatever. It's pretty, but it just doesn't match my eye look. But I'm going to tone it down with some powder. Then, I know I took a little break from recording and me and my camera, the Sony ZV-E10, have a love-hate relationship going on right now because it's just, I recorded literally four videos and the sound, trash. It. For some reason, if it's like too, if the lighting is too high or too bright, it does something to the volume, to the sound. You hear like hissing sound. And I don't know why it does that because it didn't used to do that with my other um, light. But once I got this ring light that's a little bit brighter, it was just like, no ma'am, no ma'am not having it we're not doing that yeah I just I got frustrated I got irritated and I just was like you know what just take a pause because if when I get frustrated real easily I'll stop doing something and I like doing makeup I like doing makeup I like sitting here and record I might not be the most you know talented person because I'm not a makeup artist but I do my makeup the way I like it and I hope people enjoy my content um, I'm not a young um, youtuber baby girl is 44 years old but I enjoy makeup it's like my little therapy in a way in a sense if you get what I'm saying now I will not be taking a lot of the stuff with me that I have in my collection. It's, it just doesn't make sense. I used to go ham with buying stuff. And now, I'm just like, I don't need all of this. It's just me. Stick with what I like, what works for me. And if something new comes out and I'm interested in getting it, then I will get it. Other than that, you know, it is what it is. I'm just not going to get it. I don't get PR. I do get free stuff sometimes from Influencer, but that's not on a regular basis. And it's definitely not going to be like new releases. And my coins don't run long like that, if you get what I'm saying, for me to buy everything I don't even wear makeup every day. I get up too early in the morning to wear makeup. I literally have to be at work for 5.30 in the morning. You tell me if you got time to do makeup, having to be to work for 5.30 in the morning. I know I'm just rambling and going on and on and on, but you know, I didn't have my topics all organized. We're just chit-chatting. Basically, I don't know if you want to call this like a, a life update or whatever, or what I'm going through. It's a lot. Like I said, I'm not taking a lot of my makeup and stuff with me. I'm not taking my living room furniture. I'm going to do like a move sale, post it on Facebook Marketplace, and people can come. They can have a couch for like $25, $20. Um, basically starting fresh only thing I want out of my kitchen is my pot set because that's relatively new but a lot of and my mugs because I collect mugs okay but and in my glasses I have a lot of like champagne glasses wine glasses those are coming but other things yeah no I don't need it 
once we figure out where we're moving to and get approved then what I'm gonna do is um, create me like a little list of everything that I want to buy and start putting money to the side for that because I don't want to buy the stuff now I don't have room in my house to be having stuff stocked up I'm trying to get rid of stuff so that way um, when I move where the area that I potentially want to move to everything is close by we we'll just go to the store and scoop up everything that we need highlight looks like oh I'm gonna look no cuz I put powder on I'm not gonna do that to myself let me see what I have I have so much stuff on this this is utterly ridiculous I'm gonna put a little bit of this highlight on yeah I really have to go through a lot of my stuff I was gonna say it's subtle but it's not really subtle I don't know how it's coming up on camera but it's not really subtle and I haven't even set my face and I put this highlight on you see I'm, I'm discombobulated but let's set this face I think I'm going to mm, let me use the Mac mineralized skin finish medium deep I'm gonna have to add some more bl uh, bronzer to my face because the one from Mac is it's kind of like natural looking do you see the bronzer I see it but I kind of want it to pop a little bit more I'm gonna go use it again and see if I can like build it up gonna use this lash primer from milk okay before I put lashes on I'm gonna set my face using the new power grip dewy setting spray from elf While that's drying down, use the NYX Line Loud Lip Pencil. I have a question. What videos do you guys like to watch? You know, I also be thinking like, do people want to like, watch the same type of makeup videos or whatever like I have no problem just sitting in front of a camera doing makeup because like I said that's what I like I love makeup but I also don't want to bore you guys you know what I'm saying I'm not really a fan of this lash primer but you know what it is what it is I don't know do I want to put on a lash I really I think it'll elevate the look hmm okay I'm gonna put on ruby lashes these came from I don't know which hair brand from when I got a unit but this is what they look like they're they're not too bad they're not too dramatic so hopefully they'll do what they need to do I also forgot to mention my daughter wants to go on a cruise for her birthday in October so that's another thing you know to be planning for and time just be going by so fast it's just oh, I'm putting glue on the lash <sighs> so so much to do then I have to think about what I want to do for my 45th birthday actually before all of that Christian turns 25 in July, then Jason's birthday is in August, then Kenley's birthday, and then at the end of October, it's so many October birthdays. Zayden's birthday, his first birthday, then Kendrick's birthday is in December. 
you know what, I'm gonna focus. Focus on this move, finding me or finding us a place to stay. Focus on one thing at a time before I become very, very, very overwhelmed. So this is the final look. I hope you enjoyed this little chaotic chit chat, kind of like where I am in life right now. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up, hit the notification bell. Also, don't forget to subscribe. I know I said that in, you know, a little bit backwards. So basically, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell. And as always, thank you for watching. Baby, you give me ice and fire.